I love the song Hydrated Soul because that's what I had to do. I literally had to hydrate my soul. And I've talked about it on multiple songs about the, the kind of hard times that I really went through. And it kind of all stemmed back from when I first came back from uh, Marine Corps training back in 2012. And it was like trying to get back acclimated to civilian life. It was not the easiest thing to do. It was very hard. I was very angry. I was very brainwashed. I was, I was hurt. And that followed me years and years after coming back. And I didn't really get back to where I needed to be until 2015 where I kind of, you know, I had this dream. And to make a long story short, I saw my grandmother who was deceased and she gave me two choices. I either go the way I've been going or I go the way I need to go. I decided to go the way I needed to go. Uh, later that year, I proposed to my now wife of five years. Uh, 2017, I got baptized for the first time dedicated my life to Christ uh, well 2016 2015 we got engaged 2016 I gave my life to Christ 2017 we got married 2018 we had our first son 2020 we had a daughter our first daughter but I also had a panic attack so it was like okay I got on the right path but I never really kind of address what I was going through so God made sure I address it so he sat me down for about six months and I really had to I had to hydrate my soul I had to remove all the things that were that were eating me alive you know the anger the, the hurt the, the the lack of knowledge the wondering why why me and once I really sat down and understood that and really dove into my power because a lot of times we, we especially in males we kind of take every emotion and turn it into anger instead of acknowledging what it really is and a lot of times it's just we're hurt you know as men we don't want to admit that our, you know our feelings got hurt but I feelings get hurt as well and uh I was hurt. So I really had to sit down and acknowledge that and I had to hide in my soul. And once I really removed the things that I didn't need in my life, once I acknowledged that it wasn't anger, it was hurt, and I healed from it, because that's the key, healing. Now I can be able to do the things that I do now with a stronger passion, with an understanding, and with no anger, you know, so, yeah, change, change me. <laughs>